Hey guys, so collar necklaces are completely on trend right now and I think they are absolutely adorable. So today I'm going to show you two different versions of a collar necklace that you can make yourself. They're really easy and completely pretty. So if you want to see how I did them, just keep watching. To start you're going to need a pattern. I got this one from honestlywtf.com and I'll link it below. So you're going to cut out the pieces. Next you're going to need a piece of black felt. So lay it out on the table and then just arrange the pattern pieces. I've overlapped them because I want it to come out in one joint piece instead of having to sew. And I stick pin them in place and now I am just cutting around the pattern. Once you've cut everything out, just remove the stick pins. And now I am doing the only sewing I will be doing in this tutorial. So I'm just taking some ribbon and attaching a piece onto each end and this is going to be kind of, you know, what wraps around your neck and you can adjust it so that's really cool too. I chose to sew on this one because I'm using embellishments as you will see here and it gets a little heavy so I want it to be reinforced. So choose your embellishments, take a good fabric glue, I like fabric fusion, and now you're just going to apply the glue to the embellishments and start adding it to the felt. If you're using smaller embellishments like I did here, I would suggest just putting the glue directly on the felt and then sprinkling the embellishments on top because it will literally take you forever, and I mean forever, to apply them one by one. Like, forever. Forever. You could also use bigger embellishments and that's going to make it go quickly too. So once you're happy with the way your embellishments are placed, just let it dry and you're good to go. It's so cute. Okay, style number two. This one's a bit easier. So I'm laying out a piece of plastic because I'm going to need it. I've cut out the same pattern. I'm taking some Mod Podge and I'm going to pour it quite generously, as you can see, onto the felt. Using a sponge brush, I'm just going to spread it all out. Now I'm adding more because the felt really absorbed the Mod Podge and I wanted to make sure that the surface was sticky. So yeah, that's why I used so much. Next I'm taking these really pretty glitter things, yeah, sparkles, whatever you want to call them. This is in the color bling and I am just dumping it all over the felt. So pretty. Once you're done with that, just pick up the ends gently and shake it off. You might want to add a little bit more just to make sure the surface is completely covered. Now I'm sorry, I didn't record the part where I attached the ribbon to this one, but instead of sewing, I just glued them onto the back and it's exactly the same. That's it. Really, really easy and really pretty little pieces of jewelry that you can add to your collection. I hope you guys like this. I hope you give it a try and if you do, please send me a Twitter picture because that makes my day. On a side note, these are iCat eCat nails that were inspired by Miss Jen Fabulous and I love them, so I'm going to link her tutorial for that below as well. Thanks for watching guys. I really hope you enjoyed this and I will see you guys really soon. Bye guys.